हेलो एंड वेलकम माई सेल्फ शिवम राज सेकेंड ईयर स्टूडेंट परसुइंग कमिस्ट्री ऑनर्स फ्रॉम क्रोरिमन कॉलेज टूडे वी विल सी हाउ टू डू हाइड्रोलिस ऑफ बिंजामाइड इन लैब सो द रिक्वायरमेंट फॉर दिस प्रैक्टिकल इज बेंजामाइड टेन परसेंट एन ओ एस सोल्यूशन विच वी विल टेक फिफ्टीन मिली लीटर कंसनट्रेटेड एस सी एल राउंड बॉटम फ्लॉक्स रिफ्लक्स कंडेंसर एंड पोर्सिलिन चिप Now we will move to theory part. When acid amide or hydrolysis corresponding carboxylic acid and ammonia are formed, the hydrolysis of acid amide is very slow with water alone, but the rate increases considerably by the addition of either mineral acid or caustic alkalis. There are two type of hydrolysis. First is acid catalyzed and second is base catalyzed. what the base catalyzed hydrolysis of amide is preferred since it is irreversible benzamide on hydrolysis with sodium hydroxide yield sodium benzoate water soluble salt and ammonium ammonia gas which on further acidification with concentrated hcl yield water insoluble benzoic acid and water soluble sodium chloride the reaction is driven by the formation of a stabilized sodium benzoate salt to the stabilization imparted by the delocalization of negative charge on oxygen atom and pi electron of benzene ring the stabilization of benzoate ion and along with the expulsion of ammonia shift the equilibrium reaction toward the right side in s2 group is not a good leaving group but still the reaction occurs because in s3 gas is evolved which is a stable gaseous molecule and also the product is resonance stabilized now we will see how to do its procedure in lab 1 g of benzamide 15 ml of 10% aqueous nos solution and few porcelain chip were placed in a 100 ml round bottom flux fitted with reflux condenser actually porcelain chip was taken to avoid bumping of the solution when we will heat it the content were boiled on a sand bath for 45 minutes the sand bath allow us to do uniform cooling of the solution the reaction mixture was cooled and poured into a beaker containing approx 50 ml ice cold water the mixture was acidified using concentrated hcl solution with continuous stirring till the white precipitate of benzoic acid was obtained white precipitate was filtered using suction pump and washed with cold water the white solid was obtained and dried in oven the yield and melting point of recrystallized sample was reported we will do the uh, yield find the yield and find the melting point of dried compound because when the compound uh, will be uh, was wet then we can't get the appropriate or accurate melting point now we will see the reaction the reaction is when benzamide treated with sodium hydroxide it will form sodium benzoate and when sodium benzoate be treated with concentrated hcl it will form benzoic acid now the reaction mechanism as we know the carbonyl carbon having slightly positive charge and oxygen having slightly negative charge so when the nucleophilic uh, oh minus attack uh, nucleophilic uh, oh minus will present there then it will easily then it will easily attack the carbonyl carbon of the benzamide and it will form a tetrahedral intermediate now this oh minus will come here to form a pi bond and this ns2 will liberate it will leave the uh, this uh, tetrahedral intermediate and it will form the benzoic acid and uh, this sodium amide now the protein uh, proton exchange will take place and this will uh, uh, form the the protein exchange will take place this oh minus will go here to form the ammonia gas and uh, here sodium will come and it will form sodium benzoate and when it will treated with concentrated hcl it will form benzoic acid which is white precipitate and water soluble at the same time plus nacl now the result part the yield of the product of benzoic acid will be uh, written here and the melting point of the recrystallized sample will be obtained thank you